Next we have Neil Schoen from Journey and here's an example from the song Wheel in the Sky. Okay, so we're dealing with some nice, uh, cool arpeggios, and uh, you know Neil Schoen loved to do this kind of thing. Uh, for example, other songs like uh, "Still She Cries," he would use this kind of uh, kind of technique. So we start off on the D minor bar chord, and it's an interesting picking pattern because we're, we're plucking two notes to start, and then single notes. So. So what I'm doing here, I got my normal <clears throat> D minor bar chord, and I'm picking the A string with my pick, and then I'm plucking the B string with my ring finger. Okay, then I pluck the G string with my middle finger, and then I pick the D string with the pick. So we've seen this kind of thing before, but the interesting thing is that we're, you know, hitting two notes to start with. Okay, so then it goes like this. It's almost like a passing chord, right? So we're on our way to playing a um, an F bar chord, right? But we hit that E on the way there. Okay, so again, we're we're just. Uh, Getting the A string with our pick and the B string with our um, with our ring finger. Now, what's interesting about this F? Uh, I'm not fingering it like a normal F bar chord. Normally, I would just bar right and then use my I would bar with my first finger and use my ring finger to get another little bar on the D, G, and B strings. But I'm going to actually do like this. So, I've basically got my pinky on the B string 10th fret, ring finger on the G string 10th fret, and then middle finger on the D string 10th fret. And the reason I'm doing that is because of the melodic figure that comes next. Okay, so, uh, I'm doing my A and B string together. G string, and then I lift off actually with the pinky, so I get the A fret. I guess you could do it that way too, but it's a real smooth uh, way to hit it by fingering it this way because then I can just lift off and I get that. Okay. Then I go down to my C bar chord down here, the third fret. This time I actually am just going, I'm hammering on with my pinky to the uh, sixth fret. It's like a little suspended kind of thing. And then I re basically repeat. C, C major bar chord. And then I, I do more of these little embellishments. Okay, with the pinky, I'm hammering and pulling off from 8th to 10th fret on the high E string. And this, that's still barred. So I'm never really leaving the, the major bar chord position here. Um, but that's basically the technique. So. Try some of these different fingerings and a uh, different way to, to pluck the bar chords. Um, and there's definitely uh, some new sounds that, that we can draw from, uh, from Neil Schoen's style.